Hey, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm excited that you're here with me today to show you my game-changing pore product. Yes, that's right. And you know, I'm not one who comes and tells you, oh, this product is phenomenal, that product is phenomenal. I don't tell you something is phenomenal unless I truly think it is. And I absolutely love this little product because all my life I have suffered from large pores. As those of you who have watched my channel over the last couple of years know, I had very oily skin as a teenager, you know, started the pimples right out at probably 14, didn't finish them until I was 51. So I had very heavy, thick, oily skin with large pores. They say pores are from acne and also sun damage. I don't think I had too much sun damage, but I did have the large pores from acne. And we all have those little things that bother us about ourselves, you know, that every time we look in the mirror, we go, oh, those pores, they're horrible. You know, we're always trying to cover them up and always hoping for a solution. Well, I was looking around the internet maybe about a month ago and I found some fabulous reviews on Amazon for this little product. This is the Clinique Pore Refining Solutions Correcting Serum. And I'll show you the reviews on it. About 300 people gave it over four stars. And anytime I see something that has between four and five stars, I know it's generally a pretty darn good product. I'll read you one of the reviews. This person gave it five stars and said, works wonders. I ordered the pore refining serum after seeing great reviews online. I've been using this product for 10 days now and already can see a difference in my pores, especially on and around my nose. My makeup looks so much smoother and my skin looks great. I would recommend this product to those who want to minimize their pores. Love, love, love. And that is exactly how I feel about this product. Love, love, love. You know, I've been using this product for about two weeks now. And today I was driving home at the end of my workday. It is a Friday here. And normally with my still oily skin, at the end of the day, my foundation would be looking kind of patchy and you would be seeing all those large pores. Well, I looked in the rear view mirror as I left work today and went, oh my gosh, my skin looks wonderful. And I am not used to that, ladies. You know, I'm used to seeing all those pores. And over the last two weeks, this product has really minimized my pores to a great extent. And the Clinique people say that there are instant optics is what they call it. They said that over time, this little serum brings healthier cells to the surface for a tighter, smoother, younger look. And I certainly noticed that that it gently clears pores of debris and rough dead cells. And it says pores instantly look 30% smaller, which I really think that's true. Once you put this on, you will be amazed right away. You're going to look better. And then it says over two weeks, clinical tests confirm a 58% reduction in pore size. And that is about what I've experienced. My pores have not gone away. And I'll show you some pictures in just a few minutes. They haven't gone away, but they look markedly better. First, let me show you how to use this serum. You use it twice a day in the AM and the PM. I use it at night after all of my skincare as my last step. I just put on this little serum and then go to bed. And then when I wake up in the morning, I clean my skin and do my AM skincare. And then I put this on as the last step before I apply my foundation. And I will say that this is a great way to save money on primer because this acts like a primer to me. The minute I put this on, it gives me kind of a smooth, glossy look to my skin. And it seems like the foundation just applies beautifully. And I think this helps it last all day long. And over time, I've really noticed that these effects are becoming more permanent. Now I'm going to show you the before and after pictures, but I will warn you because pores are very small, it is hard to see detail on these pictures. I show you my results after 10 days. And in the picture on the left, that's before I started using the serum. And again, I use it twice a day, morning and evening. And in the after picture, that is just a few days ago at the 10 day point. And as you can see in the before picture, I have quite a few large pores above my nose between my eyebrows. And then in the area around my nose, I have large pores and very oily looking skin. And here I am 10 days later, I don't have the serum on, but as you can see, the forehead pores look a little smaller as do the pores around the nose. Now I know it is hard to see pores in those pictures because I've just got my normal studio camera. You know, I don't have a microscopic camera to really show you the difference. But suffice it to say, as I'm going through my days, I'm getting compliments on my skin, which I never do. And the results of this product are so good that I wanted to do another video for you in another month to show you the continued progress. And I'm going to be adding on another Clinique Instant Pore Perfecting product, which was also very highly rated. And in that video, I'll be sharing information about that product with you too. And again, if you're not a subscriber and you're interested in following along with me on my skincare journey in my second half, then I hope you'll subscribe and click that little bell and that will just send you emails of this and my future videos. 
And also, if you could give me a thumbs up, that would be great too. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and today is no exception. I've been drawing from these Language of Letting Go cards from Melody Beatty. Okay, ooh, that's a good one. Showing vulnerability, showing vulnerability. Today I will disclose who I am to someone with whom I feel safe. I will risk being vulnerable even though I've always held back from doing so. God, help me show people who I really am and not who I think they want me to be. Oh friends, I absolutely love this card and you know, I walk a weird kind of a tightrope on this issue because sometimes I feel like I'm too revealing about myself. A lot of people say, oh Beth, you're so transparent and they don't seem to think that that's maybe a good thing, I don't know. And then other times I think I try to be too much of a perfectionist and I get all dolled up and I go out into the world and maybe some people don't realize that I am vulnerable and that I have flaws and whatever. You know, obviously everybody has flaws, but you know what I'm saying. It's just kind of a weird tightrope we walk between being open but not too open. So friends, just for today, let's try to open ourselves up a little bit more. Let's do what this card says. Let's find someone with whom we feel safe and risk being vulnerable. Let's show them who we really are, not who we think they want us to be. Take care. See you next time.